Hi, good afternoon. Uh, it's May the 18th. Uh, my name is uh, Luis Medina with Century 21. Uh, there's always something happening in real estate, and uh, so I always want to share that, uh, share what happens with you guys. That way, if any of you ever start looking for an agent to to help you buy a home or sell a home, you you're well informed. And you know what to uh, uh, what to questions to ask when it's time to pick for your when it's time to look for your real estate agent. And so I want to uh, share with you uh, something that happened recently with another agent, uh, and uh, just so you can be well informed. Uh, so this agent, I have a house for sale in spring, and, and, and an agent called and he says, "Hey, uh, do you have any offers?" And, and of course, that's normal. We always uh, communicate uh, about uh, are there any potential offers on the property, or is there multiple offers, or see if the clients are if the sellers are willing to renegotiate price and things like that. Uh, and he says, hey, look, I don't want to waste your time, but uh, here's what my clients are offering. And uh, I told him, well, you know what? My clients are not looking for that type of deal. They're not looking to, uh, they're looking for full list price and we're looking for this. And he says, oh, okay, well, then, uh, then we'll just move along. Uh, later on that week, we did receive a very similar offer. And uh, I didn't think my clients were going to accept it. And I, I was telling my clients, hey, we can renegotiate this part. We can do this or we can reject this. And, you know, here's all the things that we can do. And they said, no, let's just accept it. And so that caught me by surprise because I, I, I was hoping that we could, re, you know, uh, I thought they could uh, renegotiate some of the stuff. And I thought that uh, uh, they could get a stronger offer. But, you know, it's their decision. My job is just to inform them and to uh, and it's really their decision. So, to me, it means that the other agent, the, you know, he didn't really represent his buyer's best interest because maybe his offer would have gotten accepted if he had sent in a written offer. Then it would have been a serious offer. Then I would have been obligated to present it to my clients. Uh, but he didn't. Uh, you know, with everything that we have going on today, it doesn't take that much time to, to fill out a contract, to write in a contract, to write in an offer for a property. You're looking at maybe 15 minutes, uh, sometimes even, uh, I mean, if you're new, it may take you an hour, uh, it may take you 30 minutes, uh, but it's still not that long uh, time to spend to, to send it, submit a, uh, an offer. So it, it really is, uh, to me, uh, bad service, bad misrepresentation, because this agent could have made a lot of money if he had just spent 30 minutes to submit an offer. Because my clients may have accepted it. I don't know. We'll never know because I never told them about the offer because it wasn't in writing. So, like I said, I just want to share this with you guys so that when it's time for you, when you're looking to buy a house, uh, you know that all writings, all offers have to be in writing. So, if your agent tells you, hey, I submitted an offer for you on that house, but they said no, but you know that you didn't sign any document, documentations, you didn't, you didn't do an electronic signature, you didn't sign a paper with pen, pen with a paper, pen, then you know, hey, your offer was not submitted, which means your offer was not taken seriously, uh, which means you didn't even have a chance at buying the house. And if you really love that house, you missed you that's a missed opportunity so uh, just want to share that with you let me know what your thoughts are about that process or if you have any questions about the home buying process here in the houston area or if you're thinking of sending let me know i'm, I'm a i'm a great uh agent i love to help sellers uh, get their property sold my number is 713-884-0502 or you can visit my website tophoustonhomes.com once again the number is 713-884 0502. My name is Luis Medina with Century 21 to find a home in the States. Uh, talk to you guys later. Enjoy your weekend. Bye.